I'm making this video to let you know of the latest uh, research I'm doing. I'm trying to do research and experiments where we won't need the government, won't need politics, won't need the police, won't even need religion. You see, I've been studying that Moses and the Israelites, when they got into Egypt and they got into the desert, for example, someone may have been a general contractor in Egypt. They were an Israelite and they were a general contractor in Egypt. When they got into the desert, they were a general contractor in the desert. And so I'm doing research and experiments where we will need, it would be good that we don't need the government, we don't need politics, we don't need religion, We'd be like Moses and the Israelites. Or we don't need government. Uh, you know, someone would deliver the mail. Someone would haul away all the garbage. Someone would provide the firefighting service. Someone would provide whatever services needed, but it wouldn't be the government. It would just be the people themselves. I feel that the people themselves, the ordinary, just to say that the people themselves, they ought to govern themselves. Why should they have government? Why should they have politicians? Why should we have religion? All that stuff is corrupt. Politics is just plain pure corruption. So is religion. Police. You know, that in, 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 in the school systems, they're corrupt, and the mainstream media there's corrupt. It's all corrupt and evil and no good. So I'm doing research on like when when the Israelites were in Egypt, they may have been stone cutters and they may be builders and architects and what have you in Egypt. In Egypt, they may have been general contractors back in Egypt. But when they left Egypt, but went into the desert with Moses, they were general contractors just like they were in Egypt, but only now it was in the, de in the wilderness. In the wilderness. Not in Egypt. I mean, they were still contractors. Only difference is they were in the government contractors no more than now they became wilderness contractors. We can have, we can have, it's no more government uh, services. Now it's just ordinary civilian services. Someone would, they wouldn't be a government firefighter anymore. They would be a civilian firefighter, civilian mailman, civilian, uh, Garbage man, you know, civilian contractor. And if you read 
Samuel, second, the book of Second Samuel, chapter eight. Second Samuel, chapter eight, and I, I think there you'll find where the people wanted the king, and the Messiah says. No king, he was not in the very, very beginning because he knew how arrogant the king would be. And you can read all about that in Samuel, second book of Samuel, chapter 8, how the king was arrogant. And even the Messiah, he was, uh, that said, the she. And he preferred not to give them a king, but they wanted the king, so the Mosai gave them a king, and ever since then, it's not been good. Politics is pure corruption. Politics is just pure corruption, so is religion, so, so is police. So is everything. I mean, everything is... I'm, I'm trying to get that. That was called the Wicked Beast System. And researching how we'll, we'll uh, you know, like our kids, our children, and all that day schooling, rather than send them to school, how about homeschooling them if you can. If you can homeschool them, it would be better to homeschool them and break away, get ye out of this wicked base system. Because you know some this tracker convoy is showing me one thing, the people are just fed up anymore. They're fed up with government, they're fed up with a lot of things. They're fed up with government. They're fed up with the government overreach. They're fed up with politics. They're fed up with religion. They're fed up with the whole thing. And they're probably gonna, they're probably, I mean, they're probably gonna, well, there's been talk that something like they would overthrow the government, and I believe it. I believe it. I believe that the people, they they will get to the point where they will they will at least try to overthrow the government. And there's people that really do believe in the creator, for real. They really do believe in the creator of all things, the creator of heaven and earth. There's people that are just fed up with that. And I think that that, that may happen in the future. There be no more government. No more politics, no more police, no more religion, no more school systems. Everything will be private. Uh, people will live like they did when, when the Israelites got out of Egypt. I remember I had an Italian friend who told me there were places of communities in countries like Africa where they were self-governing. They didn't have a government. They don't have politics. They don't have religion. They don't have none of that. Said they don't even have schools. They homeschool their kids. Uh, if someone delivers mail, someone in the community uh, takes the garbage out, someone in the community puts out the fires, someone in the community sweeps and cleans the streets, someone in the community attends the gardens, the public gardens, 
You know, they can nothing. And I think I can see that that's probably coming. People nowadays are just plainly fed up. And you know, it wouldn't surprise me. Don't be surprised if one day they do overthrow the government. And you know, some the most high creator. He brought down the Pharaoh of Egypt. He brought down the Pharaoh of Egypt. He brought down the Roman Empire. So there's nothing, no army more powerful than the Most High, the Most High. The Most High has the most powerful army of all. And so I'm doing research and so I'm gonna do, continue to do research. Why have government if we don't need government? Why have it? Why have police if we don't need police are totally useless. They couldn't be any more useless than they are. So let's not have them if they're so useless than they are. Another thing is religions and not the useless piece of garbage shit. Throw it in the garbage, okay? Throw it in the garbage. Throw religion in the garbage. You don't need no religion to believe the most high. You can believe in your creator without religion. You don't need that bull. And another thing is we don't need government. Let's get rid of that. You don't need government. They're too corrupt. The only laws we should be living by is the uh, laws of Yah, Yahuwah, our real God and creator of all things. And that's the only laws we should be living by, really. We should be living by the laws of our creator, Yah, Yahuwah. And politics is too crap, and so I may, may make follow-up videos, but for now, this.